If you know, then you know. I'm done with this setup, man. It's time for all new everything. As you know, I got that joint coming. Woo! Building my own spurs. This is my first build ever in life. My mama was in the computer, so I'm going to name her Penny after her. You know? So, I'm going to redo this whole fucking room. This is my area where I play. You know what I mean? This is the only area I got to play. The rest of the house is for the family. So, here we go. Let's do it.
pre-built ones perfect you know never had a gaming one you know i've always looked towards the console for gaming but kind of done with those guys man they've disappointed me on too many occasions i mean i don't know how many times xbox which is one of my favorite platforms has let me down but we're not here to talk about that we're going to talk about this amazing pc build i am putting together for myself and like I said, I'm not a wizard. This is my first time. So let's start off with the facts, right? A, gaming case. This is the Game KM High Airflow 2 ATX gaming mother, uh, uh, not motherboard, but gaming case. This is the motherboard, I'm sorry. But the reason why I chose this, eSports recommended it as one of the best cases for 2021. As well as I like the open concept and the reason, the way I could put and customize pretty much about 10 to 11 fans in this case. So that was pretty neat to me. Um, I also went and purchased some extra fans. The red ones, of course. That's the concept I'm going with, red and black. That's my thing from Chicago. So, you know, now we get out. Um, moving on to the cooler. I got the IQ H150 Elite from Corsair. It's the newer, newer cooler, should I say. It's not the newest, because I've seen ones that were, you know, a little slightly up there. But for what I was trying to do, this was going to be sufficient. Motherboard. We are using the Asus Maximum Hero 13. So when I was doing my research, I was looking to see, like, you know, what was the best stuff out there. Because I was pretty much building everything around. This graphic card I got right here, uh, the 3070 RTX. So I was kind of trying to come as, pow as powerful as I could, right? So I did research and no motherboard compared to this overclocking beast. Not saying that I'm a wizard, but I am going to learn how to overclock that beast, right? So anyways, got the 3600 megahertz Corsair DDR4. 32 gigabytes of RAM. Okay, started off with upgradable, of course. Two terabytes of the crucial SSD for that uh, very fast speed. Two terabytes of the Barracuda hard drive. Also picked up another one of those, two, so that's four. I will try to install both of those. Uh, got the i9 unlocked, 10th gen processor. Reason why I went with the A50 instead of the 911 gen is because for the money and the power that it actually puts out, this is pretty much what you got right here. The A50. You can ask any scientist out there. Like I said, I'm not a wizard, but I did do a lot of research. And that sums it up for what I'm putting in there today. Uh, I got a few other things coming, like my uh, 4K uh, streaming card, capture card, uh, my... Uh, uh, I'm finna start mining, so it's, uh, dang, what is that thing called? I got it on the way, but, ah, uh, riser cable. Got the riser cable on the way, so, you know, we finna, we finna step into another realm of the world. The web. So, let's build this thing and get right into it, man.
Alright man, look, check it out. I'm sorry my camera died before the build and everything. I mean, before you got to see the whole build, you know, come up. But I re I, as you know, I redid the room. So, without further ado, I hope you like the setup. This is the new Cuddy Gaming setup. You ready? Roll a montage for him, booze. Hit that other side. Hit that other side. I don't hit that other side, baby. Ooh, wait. Let me tell you. Beautiful, beautiful. Oh man, that thing is even more impressive. <laughs> impressive. I am impressed. But look, look, look. Special uh, cables coming on the way, so I know y'all gonna talk shit about my cable management, right? It look like a fire pit in there. You do not want to put your hands in there. It's super hot. It's super <laughs> hot in there. Volcano shit. You know what I'm saying? You do not want to touch that. But what I'm saying is cable management is coming. Look, I got I got the custom red cables coming. I'll put that up on the screen. You'll probably see it somewhere. Uh, and they're they going to be red. Oh, man, this is a beautiful build, man. I don't know, man. This might This might be my... My favorite build I've seen in a while. Like, from all the people building, like, even the stream setup, like, the cable management is of utmost. It's of the utmost. You know what I mean? But, you know, even the, even the rooms that I see, you know, you don't need much. Just, just my little loft area by the garage. You feel me? This is the only little area I need. 
It's perfect for me, the wife and the kids, to have fun, edit my YouTube, play my uh, PC games. The kids could do what they want to do. They got tablets. They got this. They got that. And we El gato out. I would have installed this for y'all so y'all could see, but you already know how that shit go. It's just nothing. Uh, El gato everything. You know what I mean? So I'm, a, I'm definitely going to put my little El gato logo. One of these corners. I don't know. So that's all I'm gonna fix you, but I'm out of here. I'll catch y'all in a minute. I appreciate y'all for pulling up to the uh, video. And, man, make sure you, uh, what, what you wanna say? Peace. Peace. <laughs> make sure you stay safe and stay dangerous. Peace. Take time. You know what we do. You know how we do it.